this is 3 plus square. We want to find a square root of 3 plus root 5. Uh, we want to find a square root of this. So we say that the square root of this is going to be square root of x plus a square root of y. This is what we are saying. This is what is my square root. Now what we are doing is we are squaring on both sides. So this will become 3 plus root 5 equals to root x plus root y whole square. And what will this become is 3 plus root 5 is equal to x plus y plus 2 root xy. Now here what we do is that we come pair both the sides and say that the rational part is equal to rational, the rational part is equal to rational and that's the reason we say that x plus y is equal to 3 and then 2 root xy is equal to square root of y. So then you can square this then what you get is 4 if xy equals to 5. Now what you do this is your equation 1. You can find out what is your x minus y whole square gonna be. So this is gonna be x plus y whole square minus 4xy. So you got to understand how this uh, has happened. Like x minus y whole square is y it is equal to x plus y whole square minus 4xy. So when you expand it you will get the same thing. And why are we doing this? Because we will get to equation linear equation and we will solve it. So x plus y whole square is gonna be equal to 9. 4x square is gonna be equal to 5. So this is gonna be equal to 4. So my x minus y so I have to take positive one. So I'll not take the negative. So I'll take two and this is going to be my second one. So my first equation was x plus y equals to three. This was my first one. So when you uh, sum up, this will become two x equals to five or x will be equal to five by two. Then from here, y will be equal to half. Now you've got your uh, square root. So this is square root of x plus square root of y is a square root, right? So this is square root of five by two plus square root of one by two. So this is how you will be finding the square root, okay?